And the final game of Super Wild Card Sunday, Baker Mayfield led the Tampa Bay Buccaneers over the Philadelphia Eagles 32-9. Baker played a clean game, no turnovers, 337 yards and three touchdowns. And this tight end, Cade Alton, eight catches for 89 yards. I was very intrigued to watch this game because I wanted to see how the Philadelphia Eagles would respond after losing five out of their last six games. And the answer was not good. They played like crap. Jalen Hurts, I mean, he's obviously not healthy. He got the dislocated finger he was dealing with, the banged up knee. A.J. Brown didn't play. Devontae Smith had a big game, but the Eagles organization just flat out floundered at the end of the year after starting 10-1. and one. So the question, you know, is Coach Seriani going to get fired? Like, even though he just led them to the Super Bowl last year, the Eagles really did not finish the season strong. They had coaching situations in the middle of the season where they changed their D.C., and it just seemed like the team just flat out quit. I, don't, I mean, I don't want to say quit, but them boys did not look like they wanted to play that game. They looked like they was one, two, three, Cancun, ready to go home. And it's, it's, it's crazy to see a team fall from grace that quickly. I try to think, like, who, what other team did that, but I can't think of another team to go to the Super Bowl, start a season 10-1, and one, and then lose six out of your last seven games and lose in the first round of the playoffs. It's mind-boggling to me, but shout-out to Tampa Bay. Baker Mayfield, that offense is humming, that defense is flying around, and they're moving it on to the divisional round to keep their Super Bowl chances alive.